Morning everybody, Mike Bakke, Princeton Trader here from Mr. Top Step with your Friday morning pre-market webcast. Well, we're getting some bullish follow through. Uh, we got it during the regular session yesterday and we're getting it now. We're currently trading 1252, up about 15 handles off of yesterday's close. We talked yesterday about uh, looking for a higher high above 1290 on the daily chart. Uh, we got the bounce above the most recent higher low at 1208. We bounced yesterday at 1218.25 was your Globex low. Um, and now, you know, we're looking either for a break above 1290 or a lower high, which is going to begin to create a wedge on a daily chart, and those tend to be bearish. Uh, so, you know, with this kind of follow through, we may see a wall of worry climb here up to 1290. And then, you know, either we double top. Uh, or we break out. Uh, but it's way too early to tell. Uh, but it is bullish that we are getting some follow through here in light of everything that's going on uh, around the world. Today is Veterans Day. Let me just say very briefly that this country would not be a country without its veterans. It's just that simple. Um, so happy Veterans Day and thank everybody out there for their service to our country. Uh, keeping in mind that today is Friday and it's Veterans Day. As we head into the afternoon, you can see things slow down. And I'll remind you of this as we go into the holidays. You know, Thanksgiving, Hanukkah, Christmas, everything is coming up. Don't try to make something out of nothing on a holiday. Uh, it, it gets thin and you can really get pushed around. So there are great days to trade and there are days not to trade. And some of those slow holiday uh, half days and things like that are not great days to trade. So we need to start thinking about getting in that mindset. because. Here we are in November, uh, and it's going to be Thanksgiving and uh, Christmas uh, before we know it. So, currently trading 12.52 half. Uh, we've got the daily pivot down at 12.33, which was a bounce level uh, uh, last night. And, um, you know, I'll be looking for that. I'm also looking for the three day and nine day pivots, which are in a zone at 42.43. Uh, let's use support and resistance right now. Uh, current trade 12.52 half, uh, which is right up against my first resistance level, which is at 12.53.25. Above that, I've got 12.58, 12.65 half, 12.75, 12.83, 12.89, your which is your old high, and then 12.93. Uh, on the downside, uh, let's see, 12.46. 1242 to 43, which is the remnants of that chop zone that we talked about a couple days ago. You could even widen that out to say 41 to 43. Uh, in that area, uh, things could get choppy, and every time you get in there, that seems to be a battle. But it's a battle that the, that the bulls are consistently winning at this point. Uh, the 20 day moving average is sitting at 1240, 1236, 1233, your daily pivot. And at 1240, that's your 20 day pivot, not moving average. I misspoke there. Uh, 1228, 1223, and 1216. So, Mike Bakke, Princeton Trader for Mr. Topstep. Everybody have a fantastic weekend. I will see everybody Monday morning. Have a good one.